What is up everybody the Saints fan and today I am going to be showing you guys a really really awesome glitch This one actually allows you to teleport anywhere on the map and you get to stay in the same game session Which is really awesome and uh, you know although it is a glitch it's not really game breaking So that's why I'm showing you guys this is also going to be part one of a part two uh, video series I guess you could say even though it's not really you know a series but um, part two uh, I'll get more to that at the end of this video but anyway, if you do enjoy this video, leave a like and subscribe for more awesome GTA content. Now basically what this glitch does, it lets you use, you know, races, helicopter jumps, or, or what is it, parachuting, um, stuff like that, missions, all those things that Rockstar has implemented, and it lets you use them to teleport to different areas on the map, which is really useful. Now, I think a couple, you know, weeks back, or a couple patches back, they had the same thing, sort of, but, you know, you would teleport, but you wouldn't stay in the same game, and it was kind of annoying, because then, you know, what's the point of teleporting if it's in a different game? Now, what you want to do to actually accomplish this is you hit start, you go to online, then you go to playlist. Now, once you're in playlist, this menu will pop up, and once you're in this menu, all you want to do is hit create. Now, you'll have to know the actual mission or jump or race that you want that's near where you want to teleport to. I'll get more into that in a second, but I already know it. Uh, it's called a skyscraper, as you saw parachute jump and then I'm gonna hit save at the bottom once I edit now this is actually right next to my apartment so that's why I'm naming it home and my playlist has been completed now to teleport you just want to go to my playlist now obviously homes only one that I have and then you want to start this playlist now as you see the map it'll shift over to where I live you know my apartment now I'm in the city and then it'll drop down and put us into the game menu now once in the game menu, all you're going to want to do is hit B and then quit. And then you will actually spawn over here. So it's really awesome. When you actually start up a mission from the either the menu or the map, you know, just holding over the, the thing and then hitting X, it actually does not put you where you want to go, like where that it's at. It just puts you in the game menu. So that's what makes this way really awesome. But now we're going to do it heading back. So as you see, we have a couple friends. And um, we're going to find whatever one's closer. So we have this one, and then we have the one next to it. That's the one I'm actually going to choose, Rocky Road. So as you see at the top left, it says Rocky Road. Now you're going to want to remember that. So then again, we go to Online, go to Playlist, go to Create. And then we're going to choose Parachute Jumps, because that's the one that's right near all my friends. And then once we hit Add Parachute Jump, we're going to search for Rocky Road. And then we're just going to add it to the playlist. Now once we've done that, we're just going to back out, hit save playlist, and then we're going to title this, uh, I think I titled it Police Heli, uh, that's another video, um, but anyway, you know, it, I titled it whatever, and then I can teleport there using the same method we just did, as you're going to see. Now one thing I will say is that sometimes it'll say the Rockstar cloud services are unavailable as you saw at the beginning of this video, so you may just need to keep retrying, that's what I did, and it eventually worked. Also, as you're going to see from this one, when you do teleport with your car, your car comes with you. Although, since mine's in a mountain, uh, the teleport that I just did is in a mountain. It's not next to me. Uh, it's sort of like on the interstate. But if you do any other one, it's, it's normally next to you. So that's pretty cool. But as you see, after we've done teleporting and backing out of the lobby, we're in the same game. And now we're by our friends on this mountain. So it's really, really awesome. Now, the reason this is actually useful, if you couldn't really tell already is you can make an unlimited amount, I think it's an unlimited amount of playlists, and you can have different teleports to different things on the map. For example, uh, my friend Destroyer, many of you guys know him, he, he was the one who actually told me about this, but he has teleports for all the different tank spawns, you know, say when you call Pegasus, there's like four or so different tank spawns. He has one for the airport, he has one for the military base, he has one for, um, you know, for anything you really could use. And that, I'll get more into that in, in one more minute, uh, that's going to be part two, but one thing I will say, and you're going to see here in a second, the airport, it, and some of the, and even the military base to an extent, some of the places, even though the races are inside of them, you can't actually spawn inside of them, it, it spawns you wherever there's a spawn point, obviously you don't ever spawn inside of the airport, so this race, it, you know, it's not going to let you spawn in the airport, but you know, it spawns you close enough and then you can get in. And, you know, it's really awesome. This also works with custom races and stuff you add from the online social club. So, say you have an area where there's no race. Well, you can go make a race and then add it and then you can do it from there. 
No, part two of this video, because this is just a basic how to teleport. Part two of this video, Destroyer is actually going to make it. And it's going to, he's going to, you know, make it on this channel, post on this channel. And uh, he's actually going to run down all the different missions and all his little teleports. Because he has pretty much everyone you could possibly need with the mission. So instead of you guys figuring out what mission goes with what and, and all this stuff. Because it, it does get a little bit complicated or, or at least tedious to an extent because you got to find the mission and the member of the mission and go back and forth well he's going to make the video tomorrow telling you guys exactly what mission to do for what so it's going to be really awesome hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget to leave a like i know this is a little bit old as well but you know i literally just found out about this a couple days ago from him so uh, i figured a lot of you guys probably don't know about it as well anyways hope you guys enjoyed again like the video share it subscribe all that stuff and as always it's your boy saint spin peace